Leaders say they will possibly no longer be offering Bay Link as an option for students beginning in January. They say the program has been very difficult for teachers and students, causing lower test scores as a result. News 13's Madeline Bierster was at today's news conference to explain all of the details surrounding this change. Right now, 83% of Bay District students are currently enrolled in brick and mortar schooling with 12% participating via Big Link. But after the difficulties both teachers and students have experienced with the remote learning option, Superintendent of Schools Bill Hussfeld is recommending the school district eliminate the option beginning next semester. Big Link is not, cannot continue the way it's gone because what we have is we have at least half the students in many schools aren't doing anything, but the teachers are doing 100% of what they're supposed to do to try to get them to. So it's. It, it's, it's wasting a lot of energy and time when those kids need to be back in school. Parents who would still prefer a remote option now have to choose between Bay Virtual School and Florida Homeschooling. However, Superintendent Husfeld says a majority of COVID exposure in the district isn't coming from day-to-day -day schooling. Most of our quarantines are coming from outside influences. They're coming from uh, social gatherings, they're coming from extracurricular activities, they're not coming from what's going on in the classroom. Since this is just a recommendation from the superintendent, it will now go before the school board on Tuesday for final approval. In Panama City, Madeline Bierster, News 13, Panhandle Strong.